Thank you, Kerry. Coming up next on The Beat Goes On is our man from Fortuna Racing Syndicates, John Gelvin. This week, a great success for Fortuna in Singapore. And another beautiful filly from Karaka is looking for new owners who will love and cherish her and watch her win many races. It's another big welcome to our man from the racing world, John Galvin. Good to be here, Jared. Hello, John. How are you? Very well today. You've had an exciting week, haven't you? Uh, I mean, well, it's the big racing week in New Zealand, yep. Cup Week in, in, in Auckland. and uh, Yeah, we've just had a fantastic Auckland Cup Week with the Derby last Saturday, Saturday before last, the Auckland Cup during the week, and a, another big day yesterday, and just great crowds, great racing, good weather, just a perfect week, really. Talk about the weather. I mean, you couldn't get better weather, could you? Well, if you're a farmer, you probably wouldn't agree with that. But, <laughs> but for horse uh, racing, it's great. <laughs> yes, although many trainers are complaining at the moment of very hard tracks. So uh, we, uh, a bit of rain would be good for us all, I think. But I wonder how many of our Beat Goes Honours actually took advantage of the uh, New Zealand racing tips we talked about the last time. Something very exciting happened. Yes, well on the last show we were talking about New Zealand racing tips and the great uh, tipping service that they provide to their clients and of course uh, the following Saturday their best bet of the day was a horse called Deliciano which uh, won in uh, dramatic style down at uh, Hawke's Bay and uh, so I hope um, our viewers did in fact take, take advantage, advantage of, of that. But there it was, the winner of that particular race mm -hmm. and uh, New Zealand racing tips had it. Yeah, so the, the thing about New Zealand racing tips, uh, as we discussed last time, many of our viewers out there uh, may be new to racing or haven't been for a while, and where do you start with yeah. selecting horses? And New Zealand racing tips take the pain out of that. You can subscribe to them. They have a 14-day free trial. Yeah, um, let's, well, let's put that information up again, shall we? E exactly. Yeah. So their website is www.nzracingtips.co.nz. They've also got a telephone number, 06 three four seven two seven double O. so give it a go knowledge is power knowledge is power, knowledge is power. <laughs> now john before we continue let's tell our beat goes on viewers there may be a few that are tuning in this week that haven't met john galvin they've been on a long holiday and so they've turned on the tv and there's john galvin who's this guy and so john your fortuna racing syndication so 60 seconds on uh, what fortuna is all about correct well fortuna is a thoroughbred syndicator and we go to the sales and we buy young horses uh, that meet a certain criteria and we package those horses up into uh, shares and sell those shares to members of the public mm. and uh, we make people's dreams come true because many people out there would like the thought of owning a, a, a nice horse but of course horses cost a lot of money so our way of doing it means that a for a small amount right, yeah. of money yeah. you can buy in and take a share. Now, John, you've got 20 horses, or is it 21? We're up to 22 now, 20, Jared. Oh, 22. Yeah. John, you've got 22 horses. You've got half of them in New Zealand and half of them are in Singapore. But the great thing about Singapore is the prize money, five or six times what you get in New Zealand, isn't it? Yeah, prize money in Singapore is just sensational. Um, and that's one of the reasons why we and Tiakau Racing, who train our horses for us, have gone to Singapore to race. And the big news this week, John, in Singapore, you had a horse called Eaton's Gold, one of your uh, syndicated horses, and it won! Wow! Yeah, a great Wonderful. thrill for us yeah. and the owners. And that's the third time he's won up there. Thank, wow. Thank you. Thank you. Humatiana, <laughs> top of the lane they come, 420 metres to go, and happy ending shows the way of Adore Raymond. Up on the outside, fantastic boy. They've dropped off, good buddy. Now Supernova really needs to dig in. Eaton's Gold is running on strongly, and Hillbelly Bear back, and behind them, happy ending is the front runner over fantastic boy Eaton's gold out in the middle is coming on fairly strongly happy ending in front but Eaton's gold closing in supernova behind them Eaton's gold after happy ending and Eaton's gold is going to surge up the front at a big old price a double for Shafiq Eaton's gold over happy ending supernova gets third big Just question guys how much did it win it won twenty eight thousand dollars for winning that race twenty eight thousand dollars well and that horse now has won three times and had many placings and altogether has now won 150000 up there. Ah, oh, horse paid for, isn't it? Absolutely. Wow. So this is what we're saying to our Beat Goes On viewers. Get involved with one of these horses and uh, like Eaton's Gold, it's already paid itself off. Yeah, it's a great There's thrill. and uh, Exactly. Yeah. Uh, it pays its way. 
But John, it's ongoing. As you say, you've got 22 horses and you're purchasing them all the time. Of course, you go to Karaka. You must spend a lot of time at Karaka. The latest from the yearling sales is there's uh, a young super sire appearing on the scene in New Zealand, a horse called Darcy Brahma. Darcy Brahma was a champion on the racetrack uh, 2005 to 2007. He was a champion two-year-old here in New Zealand, champion three-year-old and a champion sprinter at four. He raced 19 times, had 10 wins, five seconds, and five of his wins were Group 1 races, which is the very highest yeah. level. So he was an absolute champion on the track, and now he's turning into a champion in the breeding barn as well. In fact, in the last couple of weeks, uh, he's had a numerous winners. He has winners every week, but he had three group winners in a six-day period just recently. So he's a stallion that's really going places. We and went to the sale specifically to try and find a nice Darcy Brahma filly because there's actually a new fillies series being promoted in New Zealand this year by New Zealand Thoroughbred Racing called the Pearl Series. It's a beautifully conformed filly, uh, an early foal born in September, which means uh, in horse racing terms that's, that's quite early. Uh, lovely confirmation, lovely walk. Good on you, John. So, well, let's now let, g give our uh, viewers an opportunity to buy into this horse. Mm -hmm. So, what's the deal with this particular filly? Okay, a 5% share in this filly is 4750 I'm going to write that down, $4,750. And that gives you 5% ownership? Yep, and that covers all of the initial costs involved in buying into the horse. Yeah. And then ongoing costs, which covers training fees and so on and so forth, is $150 a month. per month. Yes, okay. And we're also doing 2.5% shares at $2,375. $2,375, that gives you 2.5%. You own this, you've got an ownership of 2.5% in this horse. And but it's not as expensive to run it on a monthly basis. Yeah, $75, 75 a month. And of course, if someone wants a bigger share than that, then for $9,500, they can get a 10% share and $300 a month ongoing. Wow, that's wonderful. But they need to get hold of you, John. Of course, yeah. uh, there's a very important phone number we're going to bring up now, isn't it? Absolutely. 0800. 0800. 100. 100. 100. Double six seven. Double six seven. Or so call me directly. Yes. O two one. O two one. Nine two one. Nine two one. Four six zero. Dub dub dub. Dot Fortuna. Fortuna. Dash NZ. Dash NZ dot com. Dot com. And wow. that's a very good visit as well. Now, John, when they do call you, of course, you can have a good chat to the uh, potential buyers. You can tell them more details. You can't tell them everything on the program because yep. we don't have time. But uh, where they can visit the horse, see it. All yep. This Any questions, queries, questions, give me a call. If, you want to, if you're watching the show, you think I'd like to visit this horse, come down, we'll host you, mm. uh, visit the farm, visit the horse, have lunch, all that type of thing. Lots of fun. Sounds great. Good well, on you, Jerry. We'll see you in two weeks' time. Okay. Thanks. Bye-bye.